Good morning, guys. It's about 8, 8 a.m. right now. Um, the plan is we're gonna go ahead, uh, get some breakfast, um, and then we're gonna go to this Yokohama Bay. Not in Japan. Not the Yokohama in Japan, but Yokohama Bay in Honolulu. Yeah. Let's get going. That is a bad idea to see. <laughs> 20, 10 yards, 10 yards. Hardcore fishermen here. So many fishing poles. There is no limits on the fishing poles here. It seems. And look at that giant reel. All right, we made it out to the north point here. Let's explore a little bit in this time. Every little piece down here is coral reefs, made out of coral reefs. And when you step on it, it sounds like glass. Yeah? Snap it. Oh my god. That's one weird looking dead fish. I wonder how it died. It looks like a deep sea creature. Yeah.
Okay guys, we're finally gonna do some fishing and see if we can catch some dinner today. Cause we wasn't able to catch anything last night. Yeah. The guys, so we only have two rods right now. I broke one of the fly rods that I brought. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna try to tr uh, teach these two to do some fishing and hopefully they can land a, uh, a fish or two. So we can do some catch and cook later tonight. All right, without further ado, let's get it started. I went ahead and bought the barbers because we have so much snacks last night. And then now, um, same deal, squid and shrimps. Gonna catch the first fish for today for tonight. First fish of the day. Yeah. Didn't feel anything. It's so small. That's why. Okay. Okay. Good job, Daiki. You gotta post a picture with this fish. Hey. Hold it. First fish of the day by Daiki Kun. Let's lift that up. Oh, it's a pretty fish. It's a pretty fish. Yeah. Yeah. We should probably release this guy. We're not gonna eat this. <laughs> Back to the ocean you go. Right here. Just see all that sharp edges all over this area. You gotta be real careful. It looks like same size. Daiki just got another same fish, similar size too. Is it the same guy? Not the same guy, I don't think so. It's <laughs> Daiki's second fish. Ah. Yeah, so this is the setup. We only have two, three bobbers, and we lost one. We lost one to the snag. Now we're using a bottle, water bottle, as a bobber. It works as line, four feet liter line, twelve pound monofilament, and uh, two split shot right there. I don't know the size of this hook, but pretty small, because all the fish down here are like tiny. And see if I can catch a fish as well. Daiki has two on board. Okay, my first fish of the day. It's a tiny reef rockfish kind of thing. Like it looks like a mix between baby cabazon and a greening. All right, a rockfish, some sort. Anyways, gonna release this dude. Edible fish, I hope. Yeah, it is edible. Whoa. Woo! Carry Daiki! Carry Carry on? Yes. No, I just missed it because it went inside. So I just saw the same place. Shit! Yeah! Oh my god, this is big! Daiki! It's your fish. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold here, hold here. Alright, one, two, one, Chelsea, one, two, three. Dude! Dude, dude, high five, high five! <laughs> Woo! Wait, I don't know where's the plastic bag is. Oh, I have. Thank you, that's a beautiful fish. Yes. <laughs> Guess not, we got a pound of fish, and it's beautiful fish, yeah? Yeah. Really nice color. Okay, let me put it back. Yo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Want to go to uh, Frozen Foods first? I will wait for you. Uh, yeah. yeah. Produce is over there, seafood is over here. So Daiki caught this fish. I think it looks like a snapper. Well, well based on the search we, we have on the internet, it looks like a long tail snapper or just a regular red, red snapper. So it should be a good eating fish. My knife is dull, not very sharp at all. Hey, do you want to uh, save the eggs? I'm gonna have to get rid of it. Let's just have the fillet. Mm. 
Yeah. I wish I have a better knife right now. It's not a lot of meat there. saw this thing yeah serrated edge so I guess I can just slowly work at it another piece out Good. we have so far the leaks in the leak roots and then the chicken broth or the MSG Peter calls it fish soup Gotta go to scraps gonna leave that to boil and then try to cook it for like a 30 minute at least so you get all that fish flavor okay let me put it in the fridge Okay, pink snapper. So this is the fish that Daki caught. Opaka paka. Opaka paka. Perfect. We found we finally identified the fish. Turn down the heat to small. Make it slow boil. So we get all that fish flavor, fish aroma to the soup. We got tofu, tomato, some sausage, and some fish cake. The veggie and mushrooms. Fresh mush uh, shiitake mushrooms and the leftover from last night. Go ahead. Try to add some of these. We got so much thing going on. I totally forget about the fish that we're supposed to cook. So I'm just cook it like this. Sure. We're gonna be eating good. <laughs> Yo, it is like it was. Let's see. Nothing too complicated, but just the freshness. So this is the pink snapper meat. It's very flaky. It, it reminds me a lot of the uh, rockfish that we have in California. It tastes good. Opaka paka in Hawaii. So it's called opaka paka in Hawaiian. Good fish.